Hi y'all, this is So So Blessed. Welcome to The Blessed Place. How y'all doing? I am in the kitchen, y'all. I have to go to work today, do a 12-hour shift. So I am in the kitchen before work uh, to make some dinner for myself and my husband. So let's get started. Okay, I'm going to be cooking ingredients that you saw in my last haul, my $40 grocery haul. I got some Ronzoni Penne, what, reg Regatta, whatever it is, Regate, whatever. I got some Hillshire Farm beef sausage, got onions, I got garlic, and I got um, some prego. So I'm going to make up a little pasta dish. So... I've never, y'all had a time peeling these, um, these, what are they? These, um, y'all know what I'm talking about. The garlic. I had a time peeling it because I just wasn't, I'm like, how many layers? I did not know garlic was so layered like onions. Um, because I always buy minced garlic. When I do buy garlic, I always buy the cup. But no, I'm trying to put it where my big girl pan is, y'all. So I'm trying to learn you know, to do some things for myself than rather than buying everything in a in a can or in a jar. So, okay, so I got this all chopped and minced. And I don't even know if I'm doing that right. I probably should have watched the video on how to mince onion, but I figure, hey, how hard can it be? I mean, just chop it up, right? Okay. I got that minced. I always love when I see cooking shows and people be chopping up stuff. And I'm like, oh my goodness. To me, it's like an art. It's like watching an athlete, you know, do their thing. To me, it's like a cook um, being an athlete. I don't know. That might sound crazy, but maybe some of you might get that. So I had to wash off my sausage. I don't know if you all do that, but I'm like Paula Dean. I can't stand no dirty meat, y'all. <laughs> I like my meat clean. <laughs> that Paula Dean is something else. I think she's been laying low lately. I haven't heard much from her. Y'all, I need to put on my glasses to make sure I keep all 10 of my fingers. But no, like I said, y'all, I'm trying to win with the big girl can't panties. I'm trying to do it like the experts do. You know, they just do it by touch. They don't need no glasses on. Danica, this is my saute challenge. I told Danica, because she is such an awesome cook, that um, by 20, in 2014, I want to learn to become a really good cook. Not she can just fix a meal or throw something together, but Deidre can cook. Deidre can throw down in the kitchen. And that's what I want, that adjective to just be attached to my name, that Deidre the cook. And uh, so I told her to send me, each month, send me a different challenge, cooking challenge. And this month's challenge was to saute something, saute a meal. And of course, today is January 31st. I wait till the very last day of January to participate in my challenge or to complete my challenge. To throw some water in the pan. Let's see if that, yep, that sounds like it's ready. Okay, the fat that I have chosen to use is butter. I know some of y'all will get me for that, but that's what I chose. And then I learned to add my onions first. Oh, wait, hold on. The little thingy went in there. Y'all know the little paper thingy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, lettuce. Oh. Then I have to just keep... Well, the man I watched, he was flipping it. He was ho holding the handle with one hand and flipping and his onions and stuff. Now, y'all know my onions would be all over the floor if I was trying to flip. But I'm glad I read that I sauteed my onions first and then add my garlic because they say garlic is cooks really really fast so I was glad to read that because I didn't know I didn't know which to saute first or saute them all the same okay so I think it's time to add my garlic because I don't want my onions to be caramelized yes y'all I know the lingo caramelized 
I just want them to be just sweated a little. Yeah, uh -huh, that's what a man say. When you cook it just a little bit, it's called sweating the onion. Y'all learning this out there? Teaching y'all something up in here. Okay, I need me a cameraman, y'all. Okay, so I am sweating my onions and my garlic, sauteing them all together. Now this thing, y'all, I don't know when it's done. Okay, I know they say when they're translucent. So. But I don't like my onions. I like my onions to be soft. I don't like crunchy onions. But I don't want to burn them. So this is the part where I don't really know. So I'm going to go ahead and add my sausage. And I'm going to cook and saute my sausages. And with my onions. Okay, I got my sausages and onions and garlic all sauteed. Now I'm going to pour in my prego. Okay, I'm going to add a little seasoning to it. Okay, you guys, I found some Italian seasoning that I think will go good with that. Yeah, I'm just playing it by ear. I don't know what I'm doing. But it's going to be all good. And I'm going to put a few pinches of sugar in there just to take out the tartness. I don't like the tartness of ragu and um, and prego. So i got to put a little... Ooh, Lordy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, hold on. See, that's why y'all say y'all miss my um, cooking video. Because y'all just want to get y'all laugh on. I know. I know what it is. Y'all. But if I can make y'all smile and make y'all laugh while I'm in the kitchen, so be it. Because Lord knows that's not my intention. So many of y'all say... Whenever I say I'm not a cook, so many of y'all say, D, just watch this person, watch that person. And believe me, I, I appreciate it. I save those names and I do watch and I'm going to watch and learn. But uh, y'all say, if anybody, if somebody said, if you can follow instructions, if you can follow instructions, you can um, cook. So y'all, it, it's a big difference between somebody who can read instructions and somebody who can cook. I can read instructions and fix a meal. I want to learn how to cook. Okay, you guys, this is the final result. result. And um, I have these broccoli, uh, microwavable broccoli in the bag. I didn't realize it was microwavable uh, until I got ready to cook it and read the directions. But that's okay. You know, it's even better for me. That's my um, pasta mixed with my sauteed onions, garlic, and beef smoked sausages. And then I also boiled some corn. And that's it, all nicely plated up. I'm going to eat this before work and then just take a little bit more uh, for dinner for later on tonight. Thank you all for hanging with me in the kitchen. Um, this was fun and I'm going to have to do it more often. Love y'all. Y'all be blessed.